You know, M.2 SSDs have made a major step forward in becoming the main storage of choice for PCs, consoles, and devices alike. But like with most things, they're not all the same. They vary in read and write speeds, temperature, efficiency, reliability, and overall price. Now, we've reviewed over 25 of the highest rated units to give you the best M.2 SSD storage right now. Hey guys, I'm Jim with Techie Tech News, and it's our mission to present you with the best models available and then give you all the why so that you can make an informed decision. And don't worry, I've added links to all of these products listed in the video description box below. Techie Tech News, engage! Crucial T500 – Best Value Based SSD the Crucial T500 is a high-performance PCIe 4.0 NVMe SSD that delivers blazing fast sequential read-write speeds, up to 7,400 megabits per second read and 7,000 megabits per second write on larger models. Now it's backed by a Fizen E25 controller and a 232-layer Micron TLC NAN. It offers strong random I.O. performance too. For cost-conscious users, it presents a very good value compared to other 4-gen drives, especially considering that it includes DRAM cache. However, under sustained heavy writes, its performance drops once the SLC cache fills up, leading to a slightly lower speed. Thermally, it can run hot. There is a heatsink version available as well, and even the stock model may benefit from passive cooling. Reliability reports are good. Some users absolutely praise its endurance, but there is a select few that have made mention of some firmware issues, but it is a very small complaint. For gaming, especially on consoles like PS5, its read speeds give noticeably faster load times. Crucial backs it with a 5-year warranty which really shows its commitment for quality. And as we move on to the pros and cons, we really like its exceptional value for the price. That it uses a 232-layer TLC NAND for reliability. And its performance is very high for a Gen 4 M.2 SSD. But during long transfers, speeds will become slower. It can run hotter than other SSD units. And you may need to reinstall firmware once or twice to get the best performance out of this model. So what's our overall conclusion with this unit? Well, for us, it is simple. This SSD punches well above its price class. And if you want an SSD that will perform and last, the T500 is simply the right choice. And we would recommend it to everyone. And in the future, if you need to find more tech deals, simply visit techytechdeals.com. Western Digital Black SN850X – Best SSD for PS5 the Western Digital Black SN850X is a blazing fast PCIe 4.0 NVMe SSD designed for high performance gaming and demanding workloads. It boasts sequential read speeds of around 7300 megabits per second and write speeds of up to 6600 megabits per second. Its proprietary controller paired with a 112 layer BIC S5 TLC NAND helps deliver both excellent bursts of performance and sustained throughput. In real world and synthetic tests, it shows very strong sequential performance with improved latency and better 64K write compared to the previous SN850. Random write IOPS are solid, though not class leading, and the drive benefits from Western Digital's game mode for optimizing performance in gaming situations. On the downside, the SSD can run warm under load, especially in systems without a heatsink, which may lead to some performance drops for some users. Endurance here is respectable, being somewhere around 12,000 TBW for a two terabyte drive. And Western Digital backs it all up with a 5-year warranty, again showing that good warranty is a merit of quality. And as we move on to the pros and cons, we like the Western Digital's game mode for improved gaming performance, its excellent class-leading performance for consoles, and its optional heatsink for better heat dissipation. However, this model is on the pricey side. Performance drop-off is noticeable when the drive is near full, and it doesn't necessarily deliver on the highest read-write speeds. So, how do we overall feel about the Black SN850X? Well, the Black SN850X excels for the PS5 and for PC gamers who demand very high sequential throughput and good random performance. Its large capacity options and strong build quality make for a great investment for high performance desktops and gaming rigs. So, buy with confidence. Western Digital Black SN8100 – Best Performing Gen 5 SSD the Western Digital Black SN8100 is the next generation PCIe 5.0 MVME SSD that pushes the boundaries of consumer storage with blistering speeds. 
according to Western Digital's own spec sheet. It achieves up to 14,900 megabits per second sequential read and 14,000 megabits per second writes in its large capacity versions. It uses Silicon Motion SM2508 controller paired with 3D TLC NAN and DRAM to deliver both high throughput and a strong random IOP system, up to 2.4 million. Now, despite the raw speed, the SN8100 remains relatively power efficient for a Gen 5 drive, consuming somewhere around 6.5 to 7 watts under load. In endurance tests, it's solid. The one terabyte model is rated for 600 TBW, and it just scales up from there with larger capacities. Now, reviewers say it delivers fantastic speed performance, though some note variability depending on the system compatibility. The SN8100 also supports backward compatibility with PCIe 4.0 and even earlier generations like 3.0. On the flip side, thermals can be a concern, and pricing does remain at a premium. So as we move on to the pros and cons, we like that its performance is incredibly fast, that it's rated as a high endurance model as well, and that it is backward compatible with older gen ports. But as always, you are going to pay a premium gen 5 price. There are still many users that haven't upgraded their motherboard to accept a Gen 5 setup, and the unit can run hot if the spacing is tight or there's a lack of airflow. So what is our overall conclusion here? Well, the Western Digital Black SN8100 is a high-end, bleeding-edge SSD that clearly stakes its claim as one of the fastest consumer drives available today. And if you're upgrading your motherboard so it can support a Gen 5 M.2 SSD, this might be your next SSD of choice. Crucial P310 Best Budget SSD The Crucial P310 is a compact yet high-speed NVMe SSD that delivers PCIe 4.0 performance in an M.2 form factor, available in both 2230 and 2280 sizes. According to Crucial, it offers awesome sequential read and write speeds of up to 7100 megabits per second read and 6000 megabits per second write, making it one of the fastest small form Gen 4 drives. Now under the hood, it relies on the Fizen PS5027-E27T controller, paired with Micron's QLC NAND, which enables strong random IOPS despite being DRAMless. The endurance is modest. For example, a 2TB model is now rated at around 440 TBW. Crucial also integrates smart features like adaptive thermal protection, power loss immunity to protect data and longevity. And in real-world testing, especially for handheld games, the P310 proves itself as one of the fastest 2230-sized SSDs on the market, offering strong performance for its size. Power efficiency is another plus here. Reviewers note that it's surprisingly efficient for a Gen 4 drive, making it ideal for portable and low-power systems. But on the downside, its QLC-based architecture limits its endurance compared to TLC SSDs, and its DRAMless design means that its performance may taper under heavy sustained loads. And as we move on to the pros and cons, we like its great performance for such a great price. That it's also available in an M.2 2230 form factor for small devices. And that it's power and thermally efficient. But its QLC NAND configuration is not as durable as TLC. Its DRAMless design could show a drop in performance under heavy loads. And you may run into bottlenecks if your cache is constantly full. So how do we overall feel about this drive? Well, we think that the P310 is a fantastic choice if money is tight or you need something compact and want the speeds of a Gen 4 SSD, especially in small form factor devices like handheld gaming consoles, mini PCs, and ultra portable laptops. Samsung 990 Pro – Best Overall SSD the Samsung 990 Pro is a high-performance PCIe 4.0 MVME SSD that pushes the limits of Gen 4 bandwidth with sequential read speeds of about 7,450 megabits per second and write speeds of up to 6,900 megabits per second. It uses Samsung's own Pascal controller paired with a 176-layer VNAND TLC, delivering strong random I.O. with up to 1.4 million read IOPS and 1.55 million write IOPS. Power efficiency is significantly improved over previous generations, with active power draw in the 5 watt range, making it more suitable for laptops. Its large pseudo SLC cache enables fast burst writes, though large sustained transfers may slow down once your cache is exhausted. The 990 Pro also supports Microsoft Direct Storage, making it a strong choice for gaming systems and especially for PS5 setups. 
Endurance here is also strong. For example, a 2TB model is rated at 1200 TBW and comes with a 5-year warranty. Its bundled software, being Samsung Magician, provides useful tools for monitoring, firmware updates, and encryption. And as we go over the pros and cons, we really like its price versus performance versus efficiency in that it comes with a large SLC cache for heavy workloads and its Microsoft Direct Storage support for boosting app load times. But its price is still on the premium side for a Gen 4 M.2 SSD. Like all SSDs, you will notice slower speeds once the SL cache is filled and proper airflow or thermal efficiency is recommended if you want the best performance. So what's our overall thoughts of this unit? Well, the Samsung 990 Pro is one of the top tier Gen 4 NVMe SSDs available, offering class-leading speeds, excellent random I.O. and strong endurance backed by Samsung's excellent reputation. It's one of the SSDs that we would recommend if we had to choose just one, and it's our number one pick to all of our viewers. Hey folks, thanks for watching. If you have any questions at all, please post them in the comment section below and I will personally assist you. And also remember that Amazon has an excellent return policy to help you minimize the risk. And as always, please let us know which M.2 SSD you would choose. Again, links to all of these items are posted in the video description box below. And guys, when you're done, you gotta check out the next video.